Hello everybody, my name is Jad, welcome to another MLB 9 Innings 21 video, and in today's video we will be opening up a lot of packs, doing some combos, using some skill change tickets, and finally selecting our LeMayu Prime from our event. So, for a while now we've been doing this kind of event in the background with the Pick a Prime event, and I don't have any other reason to pick anyone other than DJ LeMayu because there isn't really another Prime that I need. I don't need any dupe Primes, I don't need a Judge Primes, so we're going for the one card I've kind of wanted for a while now, which is going to be LeMayhew, because I've got nothing else to really go for here. I've got no vintages that I need, and I've got no primes that I need, so we're going to just do that. I think it's this one. I believe that... Yeah, I should have enough points. I believe I do. So let's go prime. Haven't really been... I'm going to take a silver, because I don't really care that much. Um... I think he's the only, like, third base prime we have because center field, right field, starting pitcher can be can be Wong. Relief pitcher can be Batances. Catcher can be Posada. And um, second base, I don't think Kendo is in the game right now, but I'm just going to select third base just for the heck of it. Yeah, I've got enough points. I was like, do I have enough points? All right, here we go. Card sent. It should be LeMahieu. Like, I don't think we have any other primes. Yeah, Silver LeMahieu 20. I was like, I don't think we have another one. So we finally have our DJ LeMahieu 20 prime. Um, it's a little underwhelming, honestly. Like, it feels like just kind of like it was just handed to me. But that's okay. Uh, love the card. He had an amazing year that year. I mean, obviously, batting title. First time in both leagues anyone's done it. So really happy about that. And I think that also counts as an award winner, too. Yes, sir. I might... I don't think I'm ever going to GI him, but we'll see what happens in the future. I don't know. We may, we, may have a, we may have a random grade increase ticket at some point and just, you know, throw him up there and just put him on the bench just for the heck of it. Just because we... Uh, Diamond Prime gain a little extra overall, especially if I don't get his SIG, then, you know, that's all the much more reason to do it. But um, if not, then that's fine. Uh, you know, I'll have him for a rainy day. Don't think I have any other bronzes, do I? No, I don't think so. Nope, I got a bronze back. Okay, that's fine. Dump off the woodruff. Get some points for that. Thank you very much. Thanks for playing. So, let's see what we've got. We've got nine, 16 skill change tickets and a premium skill change ticket. We're going to be using the premium skill change ticket on Judge. And we're also going to be using our blue on Judge as well, if we don't get anything important. So let's go do our premiums first. So let's get those out of the way. Hoping for a prime. Probably should have done the prime second because maybe now the game is going to be like, oh, he just pulled a prime. We're not going to give him one out of a pack. But, you know, hoping for the best. Not seeing a lot of golds. It's not very good, though. So there's another matter we need to talk about, which is also the fact of team select SIGs, which should be coming up pretty soon. We just had the 21 SIGs released. So my list of what I want out of team select SIGs has changed slightly. So... I will be going batter this team select SIG pack, so I want to go for uh, my my list of things that I could potentially get are as follows, which is number one, Luke Voigt. Number two, I forgot to buy this package. Hmm. I'll buy that. Uh, I was going to buy the premium skill change tickets. Hmm. One second, you guys. I forgot to buy this package. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I totally forgot to buy that package. I wanted to buy it, and I just... It just completely went out of my brain. I just wasn't paying enough attention. So uh, we'll go some five silvers here. But I'm going batter for the Team Select Sigs. And I'm hoping for number one, Luke Voigt. Number two, I want it to be Tino Martinez. Like, those are my number one and number two needs from this. Um, soft number three would be I would really like if I could to just get the Anthony Rizzo 21 card. I, I don't know if I would really want to run that l super long term. But uh, it is an option. Uh, I'd also want, if I dupe, to then go teams, uh, club craft and either craft a Garrett Cole or an Araldus Chapman. I would need one of those SIGs very badly. Um, and then, obviously, if I were to go anywhere else, I'd like a Joey Gallo card just to make a little minor outfield upgrade. Maybe I'd have to run him at DH, and I'd have to bench Andujar at that point, because I think he actually would be better a better DH than Andujar. Because Gallo's batting numbers are honestly absurd. Uh, if you've seen his card this year, it is 
unbelievable. Like you, it's un, it's crazy. I, it's 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 one of the better sigs. I think he would be better than Enduhar just because he has higher base numbers. But I'm not sure off the hand. I'm not sure off the top of the bat. Like I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that he'd be a better DH. And I can just swap them in and out based on who is in up and down condition. And I can just have them both be DHs. Also, depending on who has better skills as well, that also be a factor as well. But that's my plan, and that's what I'm thinking of here. So, I don't know. I, I, I hope that they come out soon. Obviously, I, we haven't heard anything yet. I mean, I suppose we'll probably find out. Today's Monday. We'll probably find out tomorrow, which is Tuesday, maybe. That's usually when it drops, but I guess we'll see. Um, I was surprised that double mileage didn't actually continue into today. Usually, they usually keep the double mileage going until the team select six come out. But I guess they decided against it this week, which is weird. I mean, that's that's strange to me, but it happens. So anyway, you guys let me know what you guys are going for with your team select six and what you guys are hoping for. And hopefully, we all get what we want for Christmas this year. I know that uh, I, if I look at the batter odds i am a slightly better odds on batters so i actually have the batter odds in front of me right now if i can find my mouse on my computer screen there it is so i've got my batter odds here i didn't even realize i pulled the prime out of the pack oh i'm doing this i did not even realize this oh my god oh my god this game is awesome <laughs> oh my god Oh, come on, man. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? I literally just pulled him. I would have taken a judge then. Oh, my God. That is, that is, that is pain. That is actual pain right there. I don't even, God, are you kidding me? I finally pulled Team Prime, and it's the one I literally just pulled from the event. Man, I would have pulled a, I would have pulled a judge then. That's like the last prime I don't have of the Yankee primes. Well, fine. I guess that's a sign. Next year we're taking the Judge Prime. But I'm looking at my batter odds. My batter odds are 48% dupe, 31% happy selection, and then it is 20.7% unhappy. The unhappy odds being like, like Randolph, Gardner, Richardson, Urshela. I don't need Urshela at this point. It would only bench Andujar, who I think is a better batter. Um, and then, like, Torres, which I, I think I would actually like Torres, but I like Didi's skill set, so I'm pretty sure that I don't want Torres because then I would just have him sit on the bench forever until I actually got skills. And then on terms of the pitching side, which I'm not going pitching side... Pitching is a 50-50 dupe. It's 50% dupe, and then 27% happy, and then 23% sad. And my sad options that are not dupes are basically three Wong Sigs. And then a Regetti, which I really wouldn't be that upset about. But I'm, I'd just rather not. And then the, the, Lit, the Litke card that just came out, which is a 65 base SIG. That's a no thank you. And then uh, a Michael Pineda SIG. Which, honestly, the Michael Pineda SIG, I think, is either a 71 or a 72. Which is not bad. But I'm pretty sure that he would just basically be a copy of Hap. And I don't think I need another J-Hap. So, I'd rather not have it. I think J-Hap has better location and velocity numbers. So I, I'm pretty sure that that would be a sad option for me. It would be a nice extra pitcher. Dude, I can't believe I pulled another DJ LeMayhew. Like, are you actually kidding me here? That is, like, legitimate pain. Like, look at this nonsense. Like, are you kidding me, man? I feel like that we're going to have to just get rid of one. Or maybe just Black Diamond one and just get rid of it. Or, like, someone just tied me in a club challenge. All right, so let's go combo these people away and let's get lost in the sauce and the sadness of what just happened because my mind is blown now. Do I have any diamonds? No, I don't. Let me just get rid of some silvers real quickly and then I'll open up some gold packs and the diamond packs so that way we can go and actually get ourselves some combos. Nope, didn't happen. Okay, well, at least we got the gold out of it. That's good. So let's go open up our gold packs. We've got like 10 ultimates. 
we don't we don't get we don't get gold packs anymore because for some reason in Master League you don't get gold packs anymore. It's just not a thing. Well, that's a good that's a good ratio. Four out of ten. I'll take that. Mike for Diamond Imagine. And then we'll have just enough space left over for the team select diamond pack. And what do we got here? Come on, baby. Zach Britton 20. That's a familiar card. I'm pretty sure I've seen one of those before. Also, in terms of what I'm doing for the future in terms of my black diamond pieces, uh, I think the plan will be... That's a Miguel Andujar. That's a terrible card. He got six hits that year. That's a rough. My plans for black diamond pieces are to great increase... Uh, not great increase. To black diamond upgrade a pitcher and then start going for pitcher chemistry because I think that will be very necessary in the future. Um, I'm not sure if it's either going to be David Robertson, uh, Chapman, or if I'm going to GI my David Robertson prime and just use that as a project card. Maybe do that if I want to spend a little extra couple diamond pieces. I don't know. But uh, that might be my next shot uh, because pitcher chemistry is very important. I don't have a legend relief pitcher, and I don't think there's a possibility I may never get one. So I might as well just start going for it now. So um, I really want to get black diamond skills on Judge, but uh, as it turns out, it may be more important for me to go and actually just start working on getting pitcher chemistry on a relief pitcher. But then the other part of my brain also wants me to use a sig pitcher because my my brain wants me to then go and see if I can potentially get a good legend skill on him, such as maybe fireballer or like you know control master and then use that to then potentially help in the bullpen because that would be hands down amazing and i love how i can't pull any diamonds out of these combos this is kind of cool that'd be cool if i could like pull this like canley jansen card or not i'll just keep pulling the the random af golds out of here like hello nice didn't even get a diamond out of that combo that's that's sick thanks I don't even have enough golds to make this combo happen now. That's kind of cool. But that's my plan. I don't know how much it, sense it makes, but that's probably the plan going forward is going to be start going for Bitcher Chemistry before I go for really any more Legend skills. Um, we may deviate from this plan, though, because I might start using some Black Diamond pieces on offense because I really need offensive bats to really wake up more. So in, in the future, I, I could Black Diamond maybe. I really want to go Granderson maybe, um, get some other bats going. I, I don't think I'm ever going to replace Granderson, so that's probably the plan for the future because I don't think I'm ever going to replace Curtis Granderson. Like, there's no other SIG that I'm going to get for him, and he's one of the better Yankee outfielders. So the odds are that he doesn't ever get replaced. So that's my plan for that, and that's that's probably the way we're going to go going forwards. I mean, it's really going to be difficult. Like, personally, me is thinking that I'm going to be spending $250 for, like, 25 premium skill change tickets. And potentially, I could just be throwing it all down the drain for pitcher chemistry. Like, you could be looking at $1,000 for pitcher chemistry. and Like, that's just a difficult pill for me to swallow right now. But I'm, I'm thinking that it, it, it will help in the long run. But I just hope I really get it quickly because uh, I really want to be using those legend skill skills on other people instead. Uh, let me double check my lineup and let me see. I think I have gold people locked up. Uh, I have a gold, the Denny Henderson. Uh, I don't think I have another gold locked up. So I could unlock him and then I believe I have a great increase and we could do a three gold combo maybe. We could do that. That would probably be really cool. Hopefully get another diamond. Right? I believe I've got a couple. Believe, believe, believe I do. Uh, there are pictures, right? Um, where are you guys at? Uh, hello? On uh, the Millwood. Let's see what kind of great increase we get off of him. Don't know. I'm going to say 43. 50 dead maximum grade increase it always it only goes to maximum when it doesn't matter that's really the funny thing okay so let's go do i forgot to unlock the 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 denny henderson he's a batter no oh, i did unlock him he's at the other end though uh let's lock the the patek though and let's see what we get from our combo i'm hoping for a diamond i'm also hoping for a legend here that'd be cool 
Nice, Sparky Lyle. That's a team vintage. I don't think he's useful as a normal for me personally, but that's pretty cool. That's a new vintage we haven't seen before yet. 67 base. Um, I don't think he's worth uh, a upgrade because my worst, my worst normal pitcher is a, a 69 base because I've got Robertson and Chapman. Robertson's a 70 and Chapman's a 69, so I might hold on to him just for the fact that he's a Yankee card because I really like having one of all of them. And uh, that's a new card for me. I've never gotten him. I just got him for the first time. Sparky Lyle have not gotten him before. So that's a new card that we've been looking for, like on the back burners. And let's go run our skill changes on... on uh, I want to go in Duhar, I guess, because I'm just not happy... I'm not happy with this triple three set. I'm really not. I need to get him something better. So we're going to go back to the drawing board again, and we're just going to keep on trucking. Going to keep on trucking. And we're going to use the premium skill changes on Judge. Like I said, where is Anduhar? Did I miss him? Was he at the front? Hello? Did I not? Where is Anduhar? Did I miss him again? What? Am I dumb? Granderson Cano. Oh, there he is. No, not Posada. He's right there. Next to Batanzas. Okay. Skill change. Take a time. Let's go. Nope. Charisma. I, I could use a little bit more charisma. BIU, it ain't over yet. Honestly, not bad skills, but I'd like two golds with it instead. That'd be kind of cool. I don't think he... He gets barreled up right now, and he still kind of just is rough with BIU. I mean, he is just super sketchy with it. Trend Junkie, heavy hitter. If that was like a good gold, I would maybe have considered it. Spotlight, oh, Close. Endurance, reliable, laser beam. That's kind of trash. I'm still missing that third skill there. No, I don't really... <laughs> Slugger Instinct Ace. Uh, Slugger Instinct Legend. Sorry, not Ace. Uh-huh. <laughs> RBI Machine. I mean, he actually would be a good RBI Machine, but... Eh. Alright, so nothing, uh, nothing for the 87th time on Miguel and Duhar today. I feel like we've we've gotten at least 150 skill changes in on Anduhar, and we just have not seen anything really that useful on him uh, in terms of three skills. I feel like we're still waiting for this to kind of come to fruition here. All right, so we're going to use the premium skill changes on Judge, and then we're going to use the blue ticket. All right, so three shots for a legend skill on my guy here. Three chances. Nope. Not, not doing. Not, not doing, man. Another gold? Uh, nope. It's legends or bust, man. Legends or bust for this skill change ticket. Legend skill, contact master. I'm pretty sure that's also garbage. Pressure Contact Master is super rough, and also they're like all level ones except for like a level two. So I mean, I'm, I'm fairly certain that's just not good enough at all. Man, we we really where's the pioneer? Where's the bad ball hitter? We haven't seen those skills yet at all. I feel like we've been looking for a long long time here. I almost dropped my phone. My God. Um, and all right, let's go use the blue ticket on his main skill set, and hopefully this package will come around in another month or two, and we'll just be able to finish him up for real now. So let's change that skill. Give me something good here. Actually not that bad. I'm that's actually I'm that's I'm happy about that. That's going to be okay for now. So um that's pretty sick. That'll help a lot. Uh-huh. Sick actually. Okay, I'm actually happy with that. That's that, that's a good change. All right. So, I think that might be everything for me today, you guys. I've got uh, almost there with my black diamond pieces, so hopefully we'll be able to upgrade that normal soon and then start going for PC. 
And with that being said, you guys, that's going to be everything for me today. I will see you guys in the next video. This video might go up a little late. Um, I have to render it still. It's going to be a little late. So I apologize for those guys who are watching it now and have been waiting. I apologize. I'm getting these out as fast as I can. But I will see you guys soon. And hopefully we'll have the Team Select SIG package be released very soon. And we'll be going for our new batters. And hopefully we'll get that Luke Void. But anyway... I'll see you guys in the next video. Be safe out there, and I wish you guys luck with your pulls. Until then, have a good night. Peace.